Hey everybody, uh, welcome to Spanish update number five. So, this is Spanish update number five for the past two weeks from June 27th until today, or well, yesterday, I guess, um, July 10th. It seems that time has been going by pretty quick because I feel like I just updated it like a week ago, which is weird. But, anyways, uh, I just wanted to go a little bit today. Um, this week was, or these two weeks were a bit of an anomaly. I had a small mini vacation. Um, so for from the 4th to the 7th here, I was out. So nothing. I mean, I probably listened like five to 10 minutes worth over these four days. I'm just gonna count it at zero. It's not even worth counting. It was probably passive immersion. So I'm not even gonna put anything there. Um, for that, you know, an hour and let's see two hours here 30 minutes 40 minutes so still it's super sporadic it's really sporadic um in terms of my studying especially these past two weeks um i got a bit more passive immersion than last time but i'm not really counting that um, i just wanted to keep it there just to have a total so if you look here down here i have a little what would you say a little table that kind of has the two week average of what i did so active um, I'm really just counting the active, active immersion, um, how many pages I've read, and cards graded. So over the two-week total, I got nine hours and 20 minutes of active. That includes a lot of uh, speaking as well. So I've been speaking. Um, a lot of it's on Hello Talk, which is fun. And then uh, 15 pages read now, which is this is what I'm most disappointed at myself with because I wanted reading to be the focus of my growth immersion but i've been just having a lot more fun speaking and relaxing and chilling out so um it's it's gonna get better i'm sure it's just that i have been not taking it as seriously uh, these past two weeks which maybe it's a if i look back maybe it's a dip in motivation combined with this vacation here i mean i was i was excited man i stopped <laughs> i stopped taking care of myself during the vacation so and then um, for the cards graded, just 20, which I'm aiming at 15 minutes a day. So this is all abysmal. Averages, 40 minutes a day, um, one page read a day, one 1.42 cards graded a day. So obviously going to get better. Um, I'm starting to kind of, what would you call it? Keep track of it um, improvement wise. There's the, uh, not the Pareto principle. It's the, it's like the slight edge, right? 1% better every day and until it compounds. So right here, I just started tracking. This is probably the worst week to start tracking it, but improvement over last week. So it's comparing the total active hours, total reading um, pages I've done, total cards created over last week's total. So if you want to look at the formula, it's up here. It just compares this minus this, blah, blah, blah. You could just see it, pause it if you need to. Um, so I did 33% worse than last week. 31% worse on reading and 44% worse on cards created. So um, next week, my goal or my next update, it should be at least 1% better. And I think that's a pretty cool way to look at it until I hit my goals of three and a half hours active a day. Um, I think it was 50 pages read a day and cards created at 15 a day. So I'll go to my tracker total now just to give you an overall picture. Here we go, 56 hours, and it's getting to be around two months since I started tracking. 8% of the way to my goal of 700 hours active. Reading uh, 140 pages read, 1% still abysmal over to 9,300 um, cards created, or I'm sorry, uh, pages needed, um, and 81 new cards created, so which is only 3.5%. So a little bit um, disappointed myself. Um, Maybe you could even say a little bit ashamed. I'm trying to do better, guys. Um, hopefully, I don't want to give a rosy picture of, oh, hey, I'm, I'm a hardcore MIA or a hardcore immersion language learner. Because I'm not. Definitely, um, I've half-assed it uh, for two and a half years and still got decent results. But I don't want to half-ass it. I want to full-ass it, if that's a phrase here coming on, or um, from now on at least. So, um, yeah. Um, I'm going to take the baby steps, the small bites here, uh, that 1% better, like I mentioned. So that'll be interesting to see. Um, hopefully, I'll give you a better update next update. 
well, not hopefully, it's under my control. So I will give you a better update next update. If not, um, I don't know, shame me or something. <laughs> but uh, I appreciate you guys watching. Um, let me know if you have any more questions. I'm planning on a video series just to kind of get beginners in the groove. Uh, maybe just talk about some ideas that I had learned Spanish. Uh, maybe a video on how to sentence mine. Just, just kind of fun little things, you know. I'm not aiming to be some kind of crazy big channel or anything. I just want to develop a discussion with people around here. That'd be fun. So, um, yeah, please comment. If you made it this far, comment. I don't even care if you leave a like. Just leave a comment because I love talking to people. All right. Um, well, I appreciate everything. You guys, you know, if you made it this far, I don't know how long this video is. But I am rambling now, so I am going to say goodbye. Adios, muchachos, y nos vemos el próximo tiempo.